trimmer. Make our ball line for a low fade. We're gonna start lower down the C cup just to keep this intact so it you know, really stands out when we line it up. We try to stay close to the natural hairline around the ear. Lever open, no guard. Little to no pressure on this. Number one, lever open. Little to no pressure, trying to scoop out. C motion, gonna cover that. Please like video and subscribe if you want to have great hairstyles or improving barbering skills every day and beat the weekday blues. Close it. Over any little dark spots. All right, so this next step is crucial. One and a half. You know, depends on how comfortable you are with flicking out. Maybe a two. But with this step, all we want to do is just blend in to all that weight that's by the by the parietal. We don't really want to do too much. We're gonna connect that one and a half to like whatever this length is. And then I don't really like to go in with like a four or anything like that, just to detail at the end. Cause then, you know, you go in with a four or five or six and you probably, you know, will end up taking off too much. So I just like to play it safe. Discover fade and barbering tips in the video with the shown thumbnail. Find the link at the top of the page or pinned in the comments for more information. So now here, I don't know if you guys can see this, but we have two tones that we got to blend in. We got the one from the no guard, so the half, and like a one and a half, and a one. So we got to blend both of them together. And we're going with a half guard. And we'll just lever play. Starting off open, seeing how much I can blend it in together. where the fades or like the detailing becomes more of like a visual thing you know you can't really go by oh number number one number two you can't do that on this area it's more like how how uh, unified it looks once again i'm kind of using just uh 
the part, this part of the guard, like to anchor. But if I were to go in with like that flat on the scalp, I'm taking off way too much. And this way, it'll allow me to get, you know, length of a one open if I need to. Now it looks a lot more unified. Next, we're gonna run our trimmer and just put the corner, just kind of flick in a little bit. And really try to scoop as much as you can. And our no guard. Close, click that in. And then just detail after that. 